You're listening to a free audio download from Venue Cymru's International Concert Series. Before Leslie Garrett kicks off the new season on the 1st of October, let's look back at some of our favourite interviews from last year. Um, and I have a nightmare as well, one night before a concert, uh, that I go on stage and I can't play anything. So <laughs> that also, it's very useful actually. <laughs> I'm, I'm so blessed to be doing this, and it's really what I love, and I even get to make a living off of it. It's not just a hobby. Um, that's a really good question. You guys are really good questions. I've never had such good questions in free concert talks. It's usually like, oh, what composer do you like best? <laughs> be yourself, and also, Try to open your mind as possible. It's really my duty to uh, promote new music because I have the capacity to do it because I'm a performer and the music just won't get heard and if we don't move forward in this business, you know, we, well, I mean, of course Beethoven is immortal and so is Chopin and Schumann but you need to have new voices as well to appreciate also Beethoven and also to appreciate the new voices in it. During the rehearsal the first playing is a little bit like that I mean uh, for me for you for the orchestra we just discover each other and then and then as we have amazing musicians in the orchestra also, everybody understands everything and the second uh, read through is, is really better. And, uh, and yeah, we, we don't need to speak so much. You know, if you're trying to play a piece that's incredibly romantic and whatever, you've got to have your heart broken a few times along the way, otherwise you have no way of knowing what the vocabulary is of the piece. So, um, you know, you've got to get out there and uh, do all the stuff that people uh, people do, otherwise if you just sort of sit in the practice room and practice the whole time, you're never going to... Within the suite, the ouverture has a really special place, and tonight we, we added some more, uh, a little bit more ornamentation, in the French way, because... <laughs> Not because I'm French. <laughs> <laughs> so I lead from the violin, I lead with, I look, you know, and then I try to give entrance with whatever is free, you know, like my head or my elbows <laughs> <laughs> or whatever, you know, my shoulders. And, and uh, the string musicians, string players are used to that, so they react, and especially this group reacts in a, in a excellent, extraordinary way. Are there things you've insisted on, kind of in the shaping of music during the rehearsals? Yes. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, no, yeah, I mean, uh, Nicola made her point. Uh, you wish for that. No, I've, I'd, I mean, hopefully there's nothing that um, we've sort of totally disagreed on and that I've said, <laughs> no, I'm having it my way and that's it. No, I don't think there was any moment like that. But well, we had to submit. <laughs> 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 okay, I'm learning something, just that. No. <laughs> no. It's a joke. No, no, no. I, I hope it was all amicable. Really believe in yourself and keep going and not give up, you know, thinking that other people will, will, will give up before you. Um, but also I think just not, um, not be blind in thinking that, you know, to become a successful musician, it's only about the art, and it's not. I, mean, I don't think any career in this world, in any industry, um, you can afford anymore to, to be so selfish and you know, just you know, think about yourself. Yeah, it, everything's becoming more, more of an industry. So I think it's just, you know, I think just, just being, being observant and, uh, and putting the hard work in. Don't do it unless you can't live without it. And also, um, Stay true to your own opinions and to your own inner voice. Don't let anybody, you know, make sure that whatever you do, it's because you are completely convinced. 
Yeah, the most important thing about it is uh, is having fun. Of course, it's not always easy, but basically finding finding uh, the fun things about music. And of course, it's not at the beginning because you first have to get used to your instrument and things. And this is also what what the audience somehow wants to hear. They want to hear somebody who has fun and who is not just doing work or just just playing the piece like it says in the in the score. You also have to be creative and use your fantasy for for all the piece and the performance. Watch out for more events and updates available on our website www.venuecumry.co.uk